uh, Ian Swalwood of the uh, St. John Sea Dogs, a 2015 ninth round pick, joining me here at the Hub City Showcase. And I uh, mean, maybe we can begin by talking about your summer. Uh, how have you prepared for for this showcase and this season? Uh, I stuck around in uh, in St. John for uh, for most of the summer. Uh, I went home for a week and trained, and uh, went to Montreal for two weeks, trained and skated a lot, and then. Uh, Came here a couple weeks early and uh, got hired in the trading and skating uh, just to prepare for camp. St. John's Newfoundland native, yep. but last season played in the New Brunswick Major yeah. Midget League with, with the St. John Vitos. Tell us about uh, why you were in St. John, why was that the right place for you? Uh, I feel like it was uh, it really helped me uh, come along as a hockey player because, you know, uh, we obviously were hosting Telus Cup and uh, that was going to be really good for my development, but uh, it's also really close to the Sea Dogs, so, you know, whenever they need to uh, call me up, whatever, I was just right there. And you did get the call up. Yeah, yeah, uh, 12, 12 games last year, which was, uh, you know, it's a good experience for me in uh, heading into this year. So how last year, as you mentioned, with the vetoes and then the call up for, for uh, a dozen games, how has that helped you develop? Tell me how it's got you to where you are now. Uh, you know, I feel like uh, it's really helped me with the, like the speed of the game and the uh, just the jump from uh, you know midget to uh, you know the major junior level. It's uh, it's it's a big jump. What's the type of defenseman you, you hope to be this season? Uh, you know, I'm just trying to prove myself now that uh, I can be good. Uh, I can be just as good as in the defensive zone that I am in the offensive zone, and uh, you know, really lock down and show them I can play like PK and not just power play. And again, uh, this the showcase. Uh, again, what is, what is the opportunity? What do you hope to uh, show the coaching staff uh, here this weekend? Uh, I'm just trying to you know uh, just keep proving myself. You know, like I have been day in day out, and. Uh, you know, keep my confidence high and uh, keep building off uh, every previous game. Speaking of confidence, you're a, a late pick, a late draft yeah. pick. Yeah. Uh, a lot of players drafted that late uh, never get an opportunity. You have obviously uh, improved to the point where you are close now. Yeah, well, uh, you know, the, the draft is just it's just a number, you know. Uh, it doesn't matter uh, where you go. It's just how hard you work in that offseason and stuff like that to come into the camp and just prove them, show what you got. 17-year-old defenseman Ian Smallwood. A ninth round pick. A lot of ninth round picks just disappear off the radar. But uh, tell me about Ian Smallwood, that defenseman, and, and his opportunity. Yeah, a good pick by our staff. Uh, again, it was a combination of being a Newfoundland kid who sometimes gets lost and playing in Notre Dame, Saskatchewan. So good call by our, our guys at the table. Played 11 games for us last year. He was probably the best defenseman in the New Brunswick PEI Midget League last year. Good poise, good puck mover. Uh, has to work on his strength and his play without the puck. But but he has some things going for him, and, and he has some potential. Pretty crowded blue line back there, Danny, Again, depending on, on what happens with your, your NHL affiliated. Yeah, we got a lot of balls up in the air. That's one of the challenges. The Borel and Shabbat are first-round picks, and we're not sure of how that's going to play out. Uh, we got a lot of, we got five guys going to NHL camp on the blue line, so there's a lot of, of decisions to be made with a lot of factors. So right now, Ian has a very good chance to play on our team. Like I said, he played 11 games last year, and, and, and really is ahead of some of those guys with an advantage as far as experience. And, and, and you know, we think he's got a, a defenseman that we're going to need down the road. If he makes it, what type of defenseman would he be as a 17-year-old? Oh, puck-moving power play guy. He's got a real good shot. And I think he was second or third in the Brunswick League in goals, uh, not just for defensemen. So he shoots her well in the power play. He moves it well. Uh, puck-moving D. Uh, 